Okay, this how-to video is going to go through the, the, the Cadence help documentation. Now this documentation is very extensive because it covers every single product that Cadence releases as part of the kind of the, the PCB or the package um, software. So when I go and look at the, the Cadence help, we'll go to all programs, Cadence, the latest release or the release version that you're running, I've got a Cadence help icon. And you can see this obviously is covering all the different the functionalities and all the tools that Cadence provides. Um, now I can use the word search here and I want to look for something specific. Now in this example I'm going to look for AIDT or the Auto Interactive Delay Tune which is a high speed feature. Um, so I can literally just search AIDT. Now I know this is a PCB editor feature so I can then select the Allegro PCB editor which will maybe limit what it's searching for and then we'll click on the search icon. This comes back with the, the results so obviously it's found AIDT in the ACOMS commands it's also found it in the what's new so we can have a look at the the preview let's go and find out AIDT and it's found the AIDT command the basic commands for how to use the AIDT if that's what I'm looking for I can go back to the search results and actually look at maybe what's in the new what's new and then this will give me the what's new features and, and go through the AIDT commands in here as well now what you'll also notice is this actually gives me the actual manual or the, the PDF that the, the help documentation is found in. So if I click on ACOMS for commands, this actually is launching the A commands, so all the ACOMS, all the BCOMS, all the CCOMS, DCOMS, etc. Um, and we can go to this to launch this to PDF and then this would expand the PDF and I can then launch a PDF and look at, as I would normally, maybe use a, a control F to look for AIDT and it would then find the AIDT link and then give me the manu help manual on that. Now all of these PDFs are available in the Cadence documentation in the installation directory. So if we launch a Windows Explorer window and go to the install, so I've got C colon Cadence 16.6, there's a doc folder. So I can look at the ACOMS and there's the ACOMS PDF file. So if you know what you're looking for, you can actually just browse directly to the PDF. Um, these are kind of self-explanatory, so if you look at, for example, ALGRO, Allegro for the PCB editor stuff. Um, so it's Allegro Man for Manufacturing. We'll double click on this and look at the PDF. There's the, the user guide on preparing manufacturing data. If I was looking for some ORCAD stuff, so maybe um, ORCAD Capture user guide. I go back to the doc folder. I'm looking for CAP, Capture. So I've got a reference manual. I've got a user guide, so let's have a look. CAP UG. We'll go into the PDF. There's the ORCAD Capture User Guide PDF, and again, you can use search as you would normally. Now, another really useful location for, for help documentation, um, PDFs, user guides, uh, how-to videos, for example, like this one that you're watching. Uh, we can go to the internet, and we can go to orcads.co.uk. This then launches the, the ORCAD Code.uk website, or the Parallel Systems webpage. And if we have a look under products, we've obviously got the how-to videos. So we can click on the user, user videos. And you can start to see a list of all the user videos that are available. If we go back to products and user guides, these are some, some application notes that Parallel Systems have written specifically to go through some of the questions that you may have regards to, you know, if you wanted to create a match group in Allegro, if you wanted to do your differential pairs, there's a, there's a different how to define a differential pairs PDF. And again, these are just PDF links that we can click on. The other place is also uh, YouTube. So if we go to the, a YouTube link and look for PAR SYS EDA, there's a link to all of the parallel systems how to videos.